How to fix Gmail storage full not receiving emails on iPhone. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'll guide you on how you can fix the Gmail storage full and not receiving emails on your iPhone. So make sure to watch the video till the end. So if your Gmail storage is full and you're not receiving emails on iPhone, the only way you can solve this is by actually emptying out your Google Drive storage. If you're using Gmail, your data gets saved to Google Drive. If you're using Outlook or Hotmail, your data gets stored to OneDrive. If you're using Samsung Mail, then you get stored to Samsung Cloud. If you're using iOS, it'll get stored to iCloud. That's how it works, right? There isn't a way to actually save all of your data. But by default, Google actually provides you 15 gigabytes of free storage to store your mail, contacts, photos, or whatever else. And if the 15 gigabytes, which in most cases is taken by Google Photos app and the videos inside of it, you can actually clear out those in order to hopefully get more space for your Gmail. Now, to help solve this problem, you can just go ahead and then open the Google Drive application, right? Make sure to download the Google Drive app and then just go ahead and log into the Google account where your storage is actually full. Once you go ahead and log into the account where the storage is actually full, what you can do is basically tap the three lines option, go to storage option, and then you'll be able to find what kind of things are occupying storage on your Google account. In most cases, it's usually the photos because that's what occupies more space. To clear that out, you can just get the Google Photos app. Otherwise, you can see Gmail and Google Drive itself. You can just tap and clean up space and then you should be able to clean up all of the space or if all of the data is important to you, the only thing you can do is simply go ahead and then upgrade your storage by going and buying Google One storage. So, hope this video helped you understand the question. If you have got any questions, feel free to comment down below. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.